My name is Alexander Hansen and I am playing Michelle in The Truth by Florian Zeller at the Wyndham's Theatre. At the start of the production, he finds himself without any clothes on, in bed, showing his bottom to the audience, probably, yeah. And um, he is a man who, okay, so I've got to be a bit careful. Uh, I don't want to give too much away. He is a man who is having an affair with Alice, uh, and he's having an affair, because he's a married man. And uh, you watch him over the course of seven scenes gradually get himself into further and deeper trouble as he tries to cover his tracks and um, comes across some rather uncomfortable truths himself. Well, it's, it's so well written and it's so damn clever and it's also very, very funny. Uh, but it's very funny in a, in a challenging way. It keeps the audience on their toes and um, there's some really great belly laughs, uh, but it's a really good story. It's really well observed and uh, it's really fulfilling. It's in English, you know, and uh, uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, it was, it was tricky. We had to make decisions, you know, are we going to call, you know, how are we going to say these, you know, Bordeaux comes into it, Paris comes, are we going to call it Paris, or are we going to call it Paris, or Bordeaux, or Bordeaux, or Michel, Michel, Laurence, Laurence, you know. And we thought, if we were too French uh, with the pronunciation, it, it perhaps made it a bit self-conscious. Uh, and I think people buy it, you know, very quickly, the fact that we are playing French people in Paris, and I think we've achieved that. What is it like working with this wonderful cast? Oh, it's just wonderful. It's a fantastic company. Um, wonderful actors. And uh, we're lucky. We get on very well. Uh, we have a ball together. And, um, yeah, it's just, it's just a real treat to play. And I hope it's as much of a treat to watch. I think it is. He's doing really well, Lindsay. I've worked with him before, once before. Uh, I did uh, Oscar Wilde's An Ideal Husband at the uh, Vaudeville. Um, and uh, he's brilliant. I mean, he's just, uh, his eye for detail is, is just terrific. And I think with something like this, this play is very, very funny. Uh, but it's funny only because you've got to play it for real. If you are aware that it's funny and you play it with an awareness that it's funny, it's not as funny. And, um, Lindsay's great strength in directing this particular piece was to keep, because we, you know, we're actors, we're all tarts, we love a laugh, we love getting a laugh, uh, but his great strength was to pull us back all the time to get us to play the truth of the situation and trust that, you know, that that's what was going to get the laugh and to tell the story most efficiently. Well, it's, I mean, the Wyndhams. I've never played the Wyndhams. I've played quite a few theatres in the West End, but the Wyndhams is one I've always wanted to play, and uh, it's a beautiful theatre. Um, we started life, as you know, at the Menier Chocolate Factory, which is very intimate, and it's a joy to play an intimate place like that. But, um, you know, this is a very theatrical piece, and, the, and, and Christopher Hampton's brilliant translation, it, it's designed for a theatre, a proper theatre. The Menier is not a, is not a theatre in the traditional sense of the word. It's a wonderful space. It's great fun to play, and you make some wonderful discoveries in there. But it's only when you play there, and then you go to somewhere like Bath Theatre Royal, where we went to first of all before coming to the Wyndhams, where suddenly you are in a theatre which is designed to be uh, so efficient acoustically and for sight lines, uh, and it just lifts the whole production. It lifts it sonically. Uh, you know, and visually, and um, yeah, a real treat. Real, and you know, and for an audience to sit in, you know, that beautiful theatre, and it's really intimate as well. You know, I don't know how many it holds, 700, something like that, 800. Uh, it's a gorgeous theatre, gorgeous to play, gorgeous to be in. So if you want tickets, uh, you go to uh, delfontmackintosh.co.uk. Uh, the play is called The Truth. It's on at the Wyndhams, and we're on until September the 3rd. Absolutely fantastic. I think the truth 
as a play has really found its home here. I think the Wyndham's Theatre is a perfect theatre for it, so it's an absolute pleasure to be in the centre of the West End and we've just had a wonderful press night, so very happy, very, very happy. Well, I, I play the wife of, I, the, the wife is called Laurence and she is married to Michelle, who we know from the top of the play is having an affair. So it's, the play carries on looking at the truth and the, and the lies, potentially or is it the truth we're not sure of what comes out and how the and how the affair unravels and what's surrounding the affair I think it's the fact there's twists and turns all the way through and it's a very real situation these are very believable characters and it's extremely funny uh, but there is so much truth in it it's quite scary and I think that the um I mean scary in a good way, not in a frightening way. And it, it really just, it moves the whole time. You're always guessing. So it kept me guessing when I read it and I just thought it's good, this is going to be a wow for an audience. I think it's definitely a universal piece. There's no question about that. I think many, many people will, will relate to this piece. And, uh, and I think the, the actual ethos of it is, is very much about what is the truth and what isn't the truth and can we face the truth and can't we face the truth so it, it certainly will ring true for many people and I think for those that it doesn't necessarily ring true for they will definitely have a great time so Alex is fantastic as Michelle I mean absolutely amazing um, lovely Bertie who, who, who plays Paul he's just a dream and beautiful Frances she's just you know she's so exquisite as as Alice so it's a joy and you know Florian is an amazing writer Christopher Hampton Oscar winner I mean truly Lindsay Posner the director absolutely high class people and it's a it's a wonderful wonderful team and you know the producers as well we love being at the chocolate menier factory which is where it started sorry the menier chocolate factory which is where it started dave babani is a wonderful producer and uh, so we're absolutely thrilled christopher is so astute with his translations and he's very precise but he manages to not just literally translate he manages to actually give it a personality that fits right for a British script. Uh, so in English it works. I mean, I haven't seen, seen it in French, but it feels that this is, although we, we keep it set in France, it, it still has a very English twist to it. And yet you kind of know that it's very French at the same time. He's very, very clever at that. And the humour works brilliantly. Um, you know, it's, uh, he, he's, Florian has crafted an amazing piece and Chris has totally, has totally taken that and run with it. It's lovely. It's a very different technique working in theatre to working in front of a camera. And I love both for very different reasons. It's always wonderful to be doing theatre and hearing a live audience responding to what you're doing instantaneously. So you, suddenly the audience becomes almost like a, another cast member for us. And the pacing is so important with how we relate to the cast, the energies that pass between us. And you can't quite capture that with a camera. So it's always lovely to come back and to do it in a, in a wonderful West End theatre just makes it very, very special. I think the quality of theatre here is so incredibly high and we also have such an eclectic mix of work here. You can see heavy drama to wonderful comedy to you know, mu wonderful musicals and I, I, I mean I, I just think uh, the social plays, we have such a great mix of artists here in this country that it's very important that they, they have a home and really the West End absolutely gives great artists a home and you'll find something here to love in the West End there's no no doubt about that if you want to come and see this fantastic production then you can come to the Wyndham's Theatre which is on Charing Cross Road in the heart of the West End and we are running until the 3rd of September so it's a it's a limited run make sure you get here quickly and we'll look forward to seeing you Hi, my name's Frances O'Connor and I play Alice in the production of The Truth. 
was a, a great audience and we had a great time tonight doing the play for everyone. Um, yeah. What was it about this production that first excited you when you read the script? What made you want to be a part of it? I just think it's just such great text and it's such a clever play. And uh, I'd done a lot of serious work recently, so it was nice for me to do a comedy that was just kind of fun. Um, yeah. And I love Lindsay Posner, so it was lovely to get to work with him again. I play Alice and I'm having an affair with Michelle, who's married to Laurence at the start of the thing. And um, I guess uh, I'm feel starting to feel conflicted about it. Uh, so I kind of push for this weekend away and that that's kind of the catalyst for the rest of the play ha to happen. In some ways it's like an old coward, it's very slick and kind of polished and it goes very fast, the dialogue, uh, and there's a lot of twists in it. Um, but within that there's a lot of kind of just very human comedy and observation uh, and it's a lot of fun, I think, yeah. Yeah, I think, I mean, it, it has kind of retained a lot of its kind of um, Parisian-ness, I think, in terms of like how the, the machinations of how these people operate. But I think they're still very relatable in a way that kind of, I think, British people will um, connect to. Uh, but I think, I mean, I may think French people, you know, the French society is much more comfortable with people having an affairs in a way that perhaps Britain is not. But... Um, yeah, I think Christopher's done a fantastic job of making it, uh, you know, retaining this kind of sense of it being French, but still uh, feeling very uh, British in terms of tone and, and the dialogue and, and things like that, yeah. Well, I only get to work with Alex. We all only get to work with Alex. So um, Alex was, you know, he's such a sweet person and such a brilliant actor, so I really enjoy every night when I kind of step up to work with him on stage, it's always just such a pleasure. And he's such a lovely person. But it's also great, you know, I've, I've got to know um, Tanya and Bertie as well, so uh, we, we've all really enjoyed kind of being together as a company. You mentioned, of course, Lindsay, um, a wonderful director. Yeah. What makes him such a, a special force in theatre? Uh, I think he's just a very positive person and he's very kind of... Uh, He's very kind of exacting, he kind of knows what he wants and he's very helpful in terms of helping you kind of get where you want to go uh, and um, just very generous, I think, in terms of how he works. Um, yeah, and he's just very clever. He's a very clever man as well. <laughs> I love it. I mean, I love working on film and I love working in television, but it's great to just kind of have a a really great kind of acting workout every night where I get to kind of uh, step up and work on these scenes every night and every night it's different and uh, it's it's just it's a real pleasure too because you get fantastic feedback from the audience as well as you're working um, so yeah it's just it's a real pleasure working on this play and in, in the West End too um, and it with you know at the Wyndham's it's just such a beautiful theatre to work in too I just think it's such a great kind of uh, melting pot of, you know, these amazing, talented actors and dancers and uh, singers who kind of come together. And it's just a great energy. You feel it when you're there. Um, it, uh, yeah, it's just nice to be a part of that. But yeah, there's just such a fantastic tradition of, of theatre here. You know, from like the old Vic when Laurence Olivier was, you know, treading the boards to, you know, the National and uh, all these fantastic theatres in the West End. It's, um, yeah, I mean, it's just been a tradition for so long and, uh, and long may it continue. Yeah. Hello, I'm Robert Portal. I play Paul in Florian Zeller's The Truth. It's lovely to be back. I, I love it. And um, the Wyndham's is such a treat to play. It's an intimate theatre and uh, yeah, I, I think it went well. The play is really about uh, a man who's uh, having an affair with his best friend's wife and the lies and deceits he has to go through in order to maintain the affair and to keep it from his friends. Well, I'm the, uh, I'm the best friend, who's <laughs> the cuckold. 
And what was it about the script overall that excited you, that made you want to be a part of it? So exciting. Um, Christopher Hampton did the translation and he's a legend in this business. And Florian Zeller, it, it's, there's no fat on this play. It's just seven beautifully constructed scenes. It's so exciting. And when I read it, I thought, blimey, I've, I've got to be a part of this. And uh, I love it. Absolutely love it. Uh, when we started rehearsals, the first week, we had to unpick everything to find out who knew what when. But actually, um, we just play every scene as its own separate entity in the audience. You do the work on our behalf. Um, but it's, uh, it's beautifully constructed. And uh, every night, uh, we can hear the audience, ooh, ooh, and ah, and no, and they put their... A head in their hands and they they wince and it's just lovely for us to get that sort of reaction well this is my fifth production with Lindsay and uh, I, I guess we have a shorthand he's my most loyal friend um, I don't know I, I understand his shorthand and perhaps he understands mine um, uh, we're friends I think I hope and uh, it's just we understand each other and uh, it's very easy to work with him. Well, we started this at the, at the menu, which is, a, a, I love working there, but uh, the Wyndhams, to my mind, is the number one uh, go-to venue in London. I really believe that. It's got wonderful passing trade. It's right by Leicester Square Tube and Everything I've ever seen in that theatre has been classy. And I think it's a classy joint. Uh, and we get tourists. And tourists, you know, make uh, the, the theatre in London. They really do. They make the West End and they're a delight to play for. And so I'm, I'm very, very happy that we get, we get them in the doors. Florin has also written a play called The Lie. Um, which is uh, deals with the same four in our in in my character's house, but um, how does the truth come about? Well, I think you have to watch that, watch the show to understand what that title means. And perhaps I shouldn't say anything about that, otherwise uh, that'll spoil it. Good answer. Mm.